Hey everybody out there, Chris here, and welcome back to another Friday comic book haul. I'm going to just start calling these the comic book hauls, even though this is being recorded on Friday. Uh, lots of people say just call it the comic book haul. I'm going to leave the title on the um, thumbnail alone, but it's basically the comic book haul. Nice amount of comics this week. Let's see what I got this week. Well, I know this is for you guys to know. So, next week is going to be... Well, we'll talk about next week after we get through this week. Wolverine and the X-Men, number 33 is first. Lar Please, number two. Looking forward to what's going on here. Superior Spider-Man 14. There might be a few things that hold me to this title. Uh, New Avengers, number eight. Hawkeye, annual number one. Kate is the main um, character in this annual. Nothing really... I'm starting to wonder with Hawkeye. They kind of moved away from Hawkeye the past couple of issues, and it's starting to get me worried. Scarlet Spider, issue 19. Teen Titans, 22. Justice League Dark, 22. Halfway through the series. Superman, 22. Uncanny Avengers, number 10. See how I feel after reading this. Hunger, number 1. The Flash, number 22. All-Star Western featuring Jonah Hex, issue 22. Young Avengers, number 8. And finally, Superman, Batman, number 2. I will say exactly what I've been saying about this book. Jay Lee's artwork does not belong in a superhero mainstream book. Jay Lee's artwork definitely fits other things, not Superman. Not the Watchmen when he did the Osmandias and not anything superhero related go off and do a vampire book or something this way nobody has to see the artwork that's my only complaint anyway next week DC Comics has their annuals coming out because we are hitting the fifth week of July four annuals out of the four annuals I'm getting three I believe the only annual I did not get next week was Detective Comics and that's because I'm not reading Detective Comics so um, I don't care uh, other than that, no extras this week. However, there might be an extra soon. As you guys know, I always get something from San Diego Comic Con. So I might have something really soon from San Diego Comic Con, depending on when I order it. Um, so that's it, guys. This was the comic book haul for this week. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm going to enjoy reading some books. Getting ready for some Dark Avenger Inc. reviews. Getting ready for the review for this channel. Getting really close to 200. Ja August 31st and September 1st is the weekend where we're going to partay and enjoy some 200 awesomeness. So guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out ComicRelated.com for all your comic-related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Don't forget to also check out our group channel. I say our because Mike is behind the camera. Hello. I knew you were going to interrupt my son, so I waited. Dark Avenger Inc., where we give you guys in-depth reviews, news, everything you can think of. Uh, if you are not already subscribed to that channel, please swing by that channel after watching this video. Uh, give the um, site some love. Give it a subscription. This way we're in your subscription box, and you won't miss out on a single video we put out for you guys. We put our hearts and souls into the group, and we give you guys 110% of ourselves. The dot com is coming soon looking forward to when the website goes up lots of things coming by um, the end of this summer lots of things being planned out uh, the holidays are going to be coming up after uh, ho after Halloween very good after the summer so we got Halloween we got Thanksgiving we got Christmas we got lots of stuff that we are going to be enjoying so other than the weather being completely crazy yesterday felt like we were in fall today we're back in the 80s it's crazy stuff here in New York. Anyway, take care everybody. Keep reading, keep collecting, and I'll see you guys really soon in another video. Take care everybody.